and play with. Like, what's it like playing with all these fans? Like, like Mega is pretty freaking huge, man. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. Like on the first day, like Dave bought us like a champ bottle of champagne and and, and what, he gave us like. Know it. Know it. I bet he did. Because you right. But in fact, that wine, uh, Dave, he went, what? What wine? And then he had a card with his name on it and went, this wine? Went, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, he did sign it, though. So, yeah. even, even if he didn't send it. Wife got it. His wife got it and read his name on it. It's fine. Is it a weird feeling, like, looking up to these people as kids and, and knowing about them and then playing with them? Yeah, it's pretty weird. Do you, I can, you always laugh you get, about it. Yeah, you get used to it, really, as well. We were just laughing about it, just going, like, out of every band in the world, why us? In Australia, we're gonna play with Megadeth. It's so funny. Yeah, I'm not sure, like, if this is a real no! wet, but like how, uh, like, your singer pissed on some chick or something, and then like went to jail or something. Can you explain that story for me? No, it, it didn't go to jail. We just someone like accused him of doing it. Yeah. But there was, but, like, he, he had to go to court because they accused him, but he all got dropped. It's just like one of those things you can't really do much about at the time. It's just crazy fans and stuff. Yeah. So. Do you get a lot of crazy fans in regards to stuff like that? Uh, pretty much. Because <laughs> it seems like... It's mostly centered around Ollie, though. Like, really you'll get, like, <laughs> kind of screaming girls <laughs> and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, <laughs> really. Because yeah. it seems like your fans are pretty hardcore, like, 15-year-old girls. <laughs> yeah. They're pretty much <laughs> crazy. You don't, they're the type of people you don't want to make mad. Yeah. It's scarier than the big guys. <laughs> what consists of fun here? Well, we get we get loads of men. You get lots of men. <laughs> and oil them, up, oil them up. Oil them up and make them wrestle each other. Oh yeah. And we well, stand and basically wank each other off whilst watching the men wrestle. Sounds good. good. Sounds good. good. Kind of boy, to be honest. Are there certain people that you've met along the way that have played a big part in this band? Uh, yeah, I guess like people at labels and stuff like that. And um, oh, just like management and everyone. People like that. It's even like promoters as well who helps us out on our first shows and stuff. So it's pretty crazy. So you're good to go? You need one of them things up, you get them ones like that, flip down on them, we've got them. <laughs> So what's it, so it is crazier at home, man. Yeah. Like more kids, just um. Yeah. Well, not on last time we played some huge shows, and then at the same time we played like 200 kids in like Yoko Town called Wales. Oh, so that's a country. Do you guys like the states better? Or what's it like? What's the vibe like in over here compared to over? I think people are a bit more like crazier, if you know what I mean. Like this, they go a bit more nuts. Like in England, people can be a bit more reserved. Really? But it's just like I think it's like that in like everyday life as well. Like over here, I noticed if you go into like a, a bar or whatever, you'll be talking to someone within ten minutes, whether you want to or not. In England, you could go all day without even talking to anyone. Really? Yeah. It was pretty crazy, like, it's something we didn't expect, and it's just, I don't know, we, didn't, we never really aimed for it either. Mm -hmm. just, like, just kind of like, school, it's a blur. Like, yeah, from school to now, it's like, it's gone so fast. Yeah, it seems like five, five years, but it doesn't, it, well, it just seems like months. <laughs> That's crazy. So this is what you kind of, well, what were your goals when you first started out? <laughs> just to have some fun, really. We did, really? Yeah, we, we just wanted, like, heavy music, and we wanted to being a band like because we didn't really, there weren't really that many in England at the time so we just thought we'd do it and give it a shot. So where did things start coming together like people just started coming out to your shows or? Yeah it just it just seemed like there was there's always been like a weird like buzz around this it's hard to describe especially when you're like in the band but we'd, we'd get like when we first started like our car shows people would go pretty crazy and they just kind of pro progressed and got bigger and bigger.